This week on Save Jailbreak, we go over the new iPhone 4S unlock as well as what is going on with the Green Poison Untethered Jailbreak. Last night, Muscle Nerd from the iPhone dev team tweeted a very interesting picture of what looks to be an iPhone 4S unlock in the making. If you guys haven't been keeping up with unlocking lately, well, there hasn't been a lot to talk about. The last real unlock was nearly a year ago and it was for the iPhone 4. However, this is very promising if you do have an iPhone 4S and you want it to be unlocked. I do want to be very clear though, this unlock will be only for the iPhone 4S. It doesn't look like it will work for the 3GS or the iPhone 4. We don't have any word on when it will be released, however if you've got your heart set on an iPhone 4S unlock, definitely be sure to keep an eye out for a new Ultra Snow update. Last night was busy in more than one way. Posix Ninja from the Chronic Dev team announced that they have had some problems with the Green Poison jailbreak for iOS 5. In the blog post they explained that they did actually have some exploits, however it looks like Apple patched them at the last second. However, this is not the end of the road for the Green Poison Jailbreak. They still do have major parts of it ready, and as soon as they can find a new exploit, they will get an untethered jailbreak for iOS 5. Hopefully, that will work on the iPhone 4S and the iPad 2 as well. If you want to help the Chronic Dev team find the next jailbreak, definitely be sure to hit the link in the description as well as on the top left of the screen. That will allow you to download a crash reporter, and it will be able to pull all kinds of bugs and whatnot off of your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad, and allow them to take a look and see exactly how they can use them in jailbreaks. And as always, if there's any new information on the unlock as well as green poison coming out, I will update the annotations on the top left of the screen. The tweak of the week is Blurred NC Background. This tweak doesn't serve any practical purpose, but gives Notification Center an awesome blurred background. Instead of having a generic apple gray behind your notifications, this gives a great out of focus effect. Blurred NC Background is free in Cydia. Anyway guys, that's going to be about it for this week's episode of State of Jailbreak. If you enjoyed this video, definitely be sure to leave it a thumbs up, and if you're interested in keeping up to date with all the latest jailbreaking news, be sure to subscribe.